we know that nouns are naming words that name people, places, animals and things. Now, let us see these words here. Thief, be, photograph. Now, all these words are nouns and they are common nouns. And when I say thief or be or photograph, I refer to a single thief, a single bee, a single photograph. But if I want to refer to a collection of thieves or a group of thieves, I say gang of thieves. If I want to refer to a group of bees, I say swarm of bees. And if I want to refer to a collection of photographs, I say album of photographs. So, gang, swarm, album show collection or group. Hence, they are known as collective nouns. So, gang, swarm, album are collective nouns which are showing a collection or a group. So, what are collective nouns? Collective nouns are names of groups of people, animals or things of the same kind. Now, let us look at a few examples. A litter of puppies. So, litter is the collective noun here. A colony of ants. Colony is showing the collection of ants or the group of ants. So, it is the collective noun here. If I say a troop of acrobats, then troop is our collective noun here. A panel of experts. Panel is our collective noun. When we say an archipelago of islands, archipelago means a group of islands. So, this is our collective noun. A pile of books. Pile is showing a collection of books. So, this is our collective noun. Now let us read this sentence. The team of players are arriving early morning tomorrow. Now does this sentence seem correct to you? No, it is not correct. So how will we write this sentence correctly? We will write it as the team of players is arriving early morning tomorrow. So note that collective nouns are a singular noun and take a singular verb. So team of players, team is a collective noun and we will always use a singular verb with the collective noun. Now remember that when I say the team of players, I am referring to a particular team and so this collective noun is a particular collective noun that we are referring to. A heap of rubbish, a heap of ruins. So what do we see here? The same collective noun is used. Heap of rubbish, heap of ruins. So remember that same collective noun can be used to denote more than one group. Now let us do this exercise. Identify the collective nouns given below. A company of actors has flown to Africa for the theatre festival. It was greeted with a bouquet of flowers. A flutter of butterflies hovered above the bouquet. Now let us identify the collective nouns here. A company of actors. This is showing a group or collection. A company of actors has flown to Africa for the theatre festival. It was greeted with a bouquet of flowers. Bouquet of flowers is also showing a collection or a group. A flutter of butterflies. This is also a collective noun. Hovered above the bouquet. Bouquet is again a collective noun. So, our collective nouns here are company, bouquet, flutter. So, today we have learnt about collective nouns and how we use them in a sentence. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. You can also register for free at deltastep.com or download the Delta Step app to get all learning resources as per ICSC, CBSC, IB, Cambridge or any other curriculum. Over 5000 amazing lectures across Maths, Science, English and Social Science. Our unique interactive video technology keeps you engaged and our iDictionary feature allows you 
to quickly revise any concept. Master each topic at your own pace with our adaptive practice technology and 1 million plus questions. Get instant answers and detailed solutions. Be exam ready by taking unlimited mock tests, performance analysis with actionable feedback, personal tutors to resolve your slightest of doubts. That's not all. You can also win amazing prizes like PlayStation, iPad, watches, and many more, along with certificates through our Earn As You Learn program. So learning at Delta Step is not just fun and easy, it is also rewarding. So register for free now.